Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to my channel. My name is Ness. Today, I'm gonna do a quick sneaker review, a collaboration between Converse and a Cold War, the Eon Active CX. And as usual, I'm gonna share with you guys my three different looks I create to go with the shoes. Let's go. This is the brand new silhouette that released from Converse collaboration with A Cold War. And this is like very refreshing actually because often you see Converse that they release their new model. Either they use vulcanized construction or a cup sole construction, but this one is just a different breed. And this one is make me feel like it's belong to Nike shoe. You know Nike own Converse, so obviously they share their technology with each other. So that's no surprise there. Love the shoes. I don't think a lot of people are really into this colorway, even though it's more into a cold war colorways. You know, the grays feel like a wall and the texture on the midsole feel like a concrete. The pocket dot in here, you know, I'm not really a fan of. Um, however, I'm looking forward for the second release on this collaboration, the black pair. That shoes is amazing. You know, you see how the differences between the color can change your desire to get the shoe. This colorway, I bet not a lot of people are really into it, but I bet the black colorway, a lot of tech wear people are gonna wear that shoes. And I create three different look. I think. The styling with these shoes is very easy. However, try to avoid skinny pants because this shoes is very junky already. If you wear a skinny jeans, it's not gonna look right on this shoe. It's just my personal opinion. Maybe somebody can pull them up even better than me too. Um, before we get into the styling with these shoes, let's get a closer up into the design of the shoe. So this is the collaboration between Converse and ACW. Um, let's go straight into the tooling on this shoe. The tooling on these shoes, especially on the midsole, is remind me of the recycle material that from Nike. There's no surprise there. Nike own Converse, so you can see there are like kind of share the technology between these two brands. And also, I like the in uneven and not perfection texture on this midsole. That's pretty cool. That's why it's create its own uniqueness on this midsole. And if you go into the far foot, there also there's a different texture. And in this screen print ACW, it's a nice color contrast between the green and the yellow uh, with the colors like recessed dots. I think you can see better in the medial side without that screen print. This kind of dot texture right here is go pretty well with the pocket dot on the upper. And if you look at on the heel counter in the medial side, they have the recess of the Converse logo. So the most iconic detail on the shoe is obviously is the tooling. Um, in my opinion, because they have the exaggerated hue counter. In the back, they have the ACW branding. I don't know if you can see there. Exaggerated hue counter with the exaggerated hue kick in the back. This is go pretty well, you know, hand in hand, these two together. And if you go into the tooling on the shoes, it look futuristic to me. I mean, I never really expected uh, from Converse that able to release this kind of design. Go to the far foot is the rubberized. Overlay this kind of softer material that they use on this midsole. Um, this is a rubberized with the cut out. The main point that they cut out right here is good for flexibility when you bend the shoes, you know, easier for you to bend the shoes. And the second is reduced weight on the shoe. So right here in the orange pop, they use different cushioning for the foot bed. This is not the shank or the support. This is just basically, it's just different material cushioning comforts for your feet. 
if you go into the back of the heel kick there's a u shape it kind of rises up on the center of the heel with uh, the reset of the converse branding i don't know i think this orange is the new technology with the c plus i think this this is like converse new cushioning technology the upper on the shoes is the mixture between synthetic leather overlay underlay with uh, the rubberized material and also stretchy textile material nice booty construction with uh, the orange pop binding so it's very easy on and up they have reflective piece right here in the front foot uh actually there's a, another detail that really cool on the shoe is the rubberized from the tooling let's go all the way up into the vamp area this part right here is more like for the big toe support or reinforcements there so if you guys know what is this screen print number from acw brand then leave the comment in the comment section be below i think it's pretty well made because they are asymmetrical your feet is asymmetrical so all this pattern right here you see right there is for reinforcement there you know it's for for your feet to stay in place so when you wear the shoes without lace they can just keep your feet in place and in the front they have exaggerated pull tab that with the converse branding logo here and in the back they also have another pull tab in canvas the insole with the screen print on the textile material converse and acw this insole is unremovable they basically stitch directly on the upper so you can really remove it converse wide is fairly comfortable even though it doesn't really give you a lot of cushioning the sizing is a two two size so if you have a wide feet like me you will feel a little bit tight in the far foot you know especially here um this is doesn't really stretch but it's give you a snug fit on this it's secure your feet so not gonna slip out of the shoe when you wear the shoes you know to me i have no issue with this choo choo side definitely is a must cop but to me i think this colorway not a lot of people are really into it um the black colorways though gonna be a lot of people especially in tech square that they would get them because the shoes look very techy and i hope i can get black pairs in the future because that colorway is just sick so up next i'm gonna share with you guys how i would like to style them
So there you have it. This is my quick review, the collaboration between Converse and a Cold War Eon Active CX. What do you think about this brand new silhouette that released from Converse? I think I'm really excited for the future of Converse. I seen there's a lot of cool design come out from Converse for the last couple of years already. I hope in the future they can do a laser version on this silhouette because the sleep on is cool, you know, the booty construction, no laces is cool. But in the end of the day, I love the shoes with laces in general. This is the past for me on these shoes because without laces, these shoes look pretty dope too. And if you like one of the look how I create to go with this shoe, give me a thumb up and comment below in the comment sections. I will see you soon on the next video. I'm out.